In small town Delavan, Wisconsin, a high school football practice is underway. The players all wear the usual helmets and shoulder pads, but what makes this team unique are the athletes underneath all the gear. This is the Wisconsin School for the Deaf, and these are their Firebirds. Uh, being deaf, you're very visual. And so you'd be able to uh, join a team and do well in football because everything is visual. Well, we don't think about us having a disability. It, the only thing we can't do is hear. A lot of hearing people do think that it is a disability not to hear, but we think we're normal people. We are normal people. A graduate of the school himself, Eldred uses his position as coach to both influence and inspire. I feel that being deaf myself proves that they are able to do it. It doesn't matter whether we are playing a hearing team or a deaf team. They can play. It's the game of football. And it's the same whether you're deaf or hearing. There's no difference. On the field, you just do what you have to do. And it's the same as whether you are hearing or deaf. They just do it. They've been playing football here at the Wisconsin School for the Deaf longer than the Packers have been playing up in Green Bay. And along with a lot of the tradition that comes along with it here on the gridiron, comes a lot of recent success as well, rolling off the last three National Deaf Prep Championships in a row. We have a reputation of, ha of being a great team, and so everybody is looking at us to continue that tradition. And um, we have a good team this year, and we have a chance for these boys to do, uh, to make this championship happen. And so we, we hope to carry on this tradition. For the Firebirds, actions truly do speak louder than words. Without having that winning mentality, you can't win as a team. We need to see action. We need to see proof on that field that we can do it. We need to show uh, the lower classmen that this is something that we do. And once they see uh, what we do here as a team, they'll understand it. I think we can do it. I believe in my team. And I do think it's important, yeah. I, we do want our fourth championship. We have a good team. They win more than they lose here at the Wisconsin School for the Deaf, but it's not always about what the scoreboard reads. Sometimes the most important lessons learned in life are those we don't need to hear a single word of to understand completely. The game's not about winning. It really doesn't matter whether we win or lose. It's what you give to the game. It's what the heart that you put in your game. You do your best. You know, yeah, I am a senior, but it really doesn't matter um, whether I need to just give my all and I need to do what I need to do and uh, whether I make mistakes or not, I improve on those. Accepting this week's Anything's Possible Award on behalf of the Wisconsin School for the Deaf is senior Taylor Koss.